Yo, I'm back again. And today we're doing a Swansea player ratings, bruv. So obviously, man's got another career more coming. Man's got teams like Dynamo, Kiev, Dortmund, Young Boys, a um, couple teams that people have asked me or recommended me to do in it. Um, obviously, man might do another team in the Prem as well or Championship. I don't know, but you can't predict the future in it. But yeah, anyway, um, Swansea today, nicknamed the Swans, bruv. Owner status, enjoying life with the club. Um, now, view the squad, yeah. Now, Ben Hammer, all the way to. Liam Cullen. So, let's see what them man are saying. Still, you get me? All right, now, Ben Hammer is a backup goalkeeper. 12 agility, 14 reflexes and 10. Forget about it, bruv. Can't lie. Forget about it. Um, it's, it's not worth it still. It's not worth your time. He's six foot four. I, I get that he's backup, but obviously, if your first choice is injured, then obviously he's kind of peak still. Um, you're you're going to have to focus on the fact that you can like react fast. But apart from that, it's peak still. But yeah, um, that's, that's Ben Hammer cool. Next on loan, Freddie Woodman. Okay, now, um, obviously, he's 23 on loan from Newcastle. See, now, this is what I mean. Now, the only problem with this guy is that he's injured, bruv. So, you're going to have to use that 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 guy that we saw before. But, obviously, this guy is 23, man. has got 15 agility, 14 reflexes, and 31 one ones bruv. So, two out of the three that I need, he's got them. And the, 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 the third one that can improve because it's only off by one and he's 23. Still got about seven years to get that up by one it's definitely possible you get me so yeah a man like Freddie Woodman man will definitely um, give this guy faith still and make that loan, loan permanent if you can still so yeah them, wait by the way them man are sitting third bruv I just them man are sitting third in the championship that's mad but anyway outfield players now Ben Cabango 20 years of age 8 technique 9 vision 11 passing no nonsense centre back at least he's honest bruv not trying to impersonate a central defender that's always good to see now um, strength 15 Agility nine, acceleration eleven. Okay, now this this is what I mean, yeah. Movement gone, and he's only twenty. I don't understand how, but it's he's gone in it. But but he's brave, not composed. Listen, he's just there to win the ball. I think he can do it still. Marking very good, good in the air, strong, and he can win the ball for his for his age in it, man. That that fighting tackling will definitely go up. So yeah, for what you need him, four man's got it still. Not a ball playing defender. Don't force that on him. It's not what he's about still. So yeah, that's man like Ben Cabango. Cool. Next. Ryan Bennett, bruv. Um, 30, um, ball playing defender, 11 technique, 11 vision and 12 passing. To screen ball playing defender, I mean, that's because he can basically do everything, but it's 11 maximum, 12. It's kind of it's kind of under average still, but anyway, um, in terms of movement, bear 11s once again, man's just got 11 movement, bruv, literally. 11 acceleration, 11 agility, 11 pace, man just moving at 11 speed, bruv. That's not fast at all, let's be real. Um, side to side in terms of strength, strong in the air, can't really win headers, but he can direct them. Doesn't really. Anyway, um, he's composed, very composed. Um, what's his anticipation? 13, that's a bit on average, but he's calm. And he can win the ball. See, now, for a central defender, I think he'll be better suited to that because he can do the ball playing thing and the, and the no-nonsense thing as well. And for some reason, man can just throw the ball out of the stadium with that long throws of 18, bruv. Like, yeah, I think he, as a central defender, I'll actually put him on central defender still. I think he's a bit more than just a ball playing. So, yeah, that's what I do with man like Ryan Bennett. But he, he's good, though. He's good still, cool. All right, next, um, Kyle Norton, thirty-one years of age, wing back defend, um, twelve pace, thirteen agility and thirteen acceleration. Yeah, um, movement not really there, and for some reason, man could just play pretty much anywhere apart from left and and striker and all that. But anyway, um, thirteen technique, thirteen vision, and thirteen passing. That's that's a very that's a decent pivot. He's a wing back defend. That's actually a good pivot for wing back defend. But the only problem that I have is that man's a wing back defend, but he's got eleven tackling. So the one requirement that I'm asking you to have, man, man, man can't even do that, bro. What's going on, bro? Shocking ability. Man, man's better. At, man, man's a support, but I, don't, I can't even put him on support because he hasn't even got a cross on him. And he's 31, so he will never have a cross, bro. Man can't cross his legs. What's going on, bro? Like, like man, man's meant to be... Like, I, I don't know what he is then. Like, I actually don't know what he is still because man can't do the defensive thing. And then, because if I put him on attack, his dribbling is a bit, you know, a bit on that. But it might have to be an attack thing. But because man's got a pivot in it, yeah, um, it, it's mad still. It's actually crazy. Um, very composed, works hard. Yeah, so the pivot is good. First touch, dribbling. He's not. A, he's not. He doesn't want to do the dirty work. Let's be real. Um, he doesn't in it. So you're gonna have to make him more forward thinking. If anything, complete wing back on support. That's what I would do. Um, just get him away from that defensive side because he's not that, bruv. Don't let them lie to you in it. Cool man, like Kyle Norton, bruv. All right, next. Um, Mark Gehi. Is this one from Chelsea, bruv? It is, heard of him, heard of him. Still, man like, man like, get he, bruv. Madness, cool. <laughs> All right, what, what a name, bruv. What a fucking name. Anyway, anyway. 
um, ball playing defender or defender, 11 technique, 9 vision, 10 passing. Um, okay, I get that he claims ball playing defender. I get that he's only 20, but that pivot is not acceptable for, for, for a ball playing defender. Right? Let's be real. Um, that 14 tackling is very good. Uh, man, man's got, you no, know, his pace isn't really there. Neither is agility. Um, but can I put that down to his age? I might be able to still. Very strong. Um, composure, that will go up as well. I mean, I can definitely see this being a development card still. This is probably why he's at Swansea to develop, innit? Um, so maybe if you give him, no, no, no. Definitely give him first team football, innit? Um, I mean, yeah, give him first team football, he'll definitely improve still. Obviously, right now it's a bit, you know, like man, man's got a lot of very under average things, but I think because he's only 20, that can definitely improve still. Like, for example, the jump reach is 12, the heading is 11. Like, with time, that's going to improve, innit? Um, physically, he's actually decent, though, and he can win the ball. So it's, I don't think personally I don't think it'll be a no no I mean a ball playing defender thing I think in the future it'll be a no nonsense still because you can already see what he's gonna be like if you take away that ball playing bullshit from your from your head yeah it could actually be a, a no nonsense thing if you want it to be so yeah man like Mark Gehi brav see all right next um Connor Roberts brav who's wanted let's see why he's wanted brav twenty four years of age fullback attack all right um in terms of movement man's got decent pace it's gonna take him a while to get to that decent pace. Um, side to side is decent as well. Good natural fitness stamina all that now. Eleven technique, thirteen vision, and thirteen passing. That's that's a oh, oh that's that's a decent pivot. Can't lie. Now, um, man cannot dribble. Like his dribbling in his nine can cannot dribble. He can carry the ball. That means he'll have to knock it past the opponent. But with that pace, that's not absolutely blistering. It's not like he's gonna gap anyone. Like he you only beat people that have th probably the same pace or slower than him, and that's gonna be rare. So um yeah. Um, in terms in terms of that he can't dribble now he can kind of cross not really that combusted decisions yeah he's not really see now fullback attack is that a stretch once again Brav um, yes it's a support thing still because he can't dribble in it in tight spaces he's useless you just have to ask him get to that dangerous area like near the halfway line no no not to the half like cross from deep in it that's what we have to do yeah works hard determined and aggressive he's got the grit about him as well he's just escaped youth academy he has learned something in there mentally anyway um, technically not really but he can kind of win the now that that tackling that's 12 it's not really the greatest let's be real um, but yeah you're just gonna you're just gonna have to focus on the fact that you can kind of cross the ball and 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 his pivot is okay yeah that's my like Connor Roberts breath so yeah all right next um Kieran Freeman 28 years of age um 11 pace 12 agility things yeah he's not fast at all he's meant to be on support can i agree with that he's got 13 dribbling 13 crossing he can definitely support someone with that bruv um his pivot however is 12 technique 9 vision but 12 passing that's that's okay it's okay let's be real um he's not amazingly great at winning the ball i mean he works hard um for me he's, he's basically very bang average for me can't lie i mean he can he can whip the ball and that's about it let's be real um like in terms of comfort comfortability, you can literally whip the ball comfortably, and that's about it, bruv. Anything else is hit or miss, bruv. Like mine, definitely gonna get bun for for speed, definitely. Um, and and that last stitch tackle is not gonna be that accurate anyway. So yeah, man, um, like Kieran Freeman, I'll just keep him in in the score for rotation and that that that's if 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 you had to, bruv. You get me? So yeah, man, man, like Freeman. All right, cool. Next, who wanted Jake Bidwell? Twenty seven years of age, bruv. Fullback attack. You get me? Um. Once once again, man's just not to, he just doesn't want to move side to side. He just doesn't want to move, bruv. Now, he's a straight line kind of guy. Once again, take him off attack, bruv. He's not attacking no one. He's definitely on support still. Now, I look at the pivot and I might have to recheck that statement. I can't lie. Because of that pivot, I actually might have to recheck that statement. That pivot is shock. Man's on 11 technique, 8 vision, and 8 passing. How is it 8, bruv? 8. That's, 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 un that's absolutely unacceptable, bruv. I can't lie. Man, man, really have to just put him on cross the ball from deep and the only way you can do that is on support you can't really do that I don't think you can do it on attack I think if you do it on attack it's forced to go to the byline but if it's on support you have to actually cross from deep so that's what you're going to have to do still put him on support pray that he don't do no short pass just tell him you know what fuck it whip the ball every single time because that's what you're good at in it so yeah and he can win the ball as well so he's got a bit of both yeah so we'll just tell him whip the ball still cool man, man like Jake Bidwell alright next um, Ryan Manning brav. 24 years of age, left back that can play pretty much anywhere, pretty much anywhere apart from centre back and right back. But anyway, 12 technique, 13 vision, 12 passing. The pivot is okay. He just escaped Youth Academy. Let's see what he's learning in the Youth Academy, bruv. Now, he's not fast at all. Um, he's meant to be a complete wing back on support. Cool. Um, very good side to side in terms of movement, but he's just not, not moving at speed overall. Um, 
dribbling 12, crossing 13, that's decent. It, it is decent still. Um, you're going to have to focus on that. Similar to the other guy where he's not really the best defensively, even though this guy, he's kind of better. Um, you're going to have to do the same thing where you just focus on him going forward still. Um, because obviously he's not blistering really far. He's not, he's not going to get back in time. So you don't want to, you don't want him to get to the byline. You want him to get like, let's say deep. Yeah, get him, get him deep, crossing the ball, and then just, just get him to get back before things get sticky, bruv. You get me? Yeah, man, man, man like Ryan Manning, bruv. Cool. All right, next Corey Smith, bruv. Twenty nine years of age. Um, all right, box to box midfielder, thirteen tackling and twelve passing. Um, it's it's yeah, it's, it's average. But anyway, um. The pivot over with 12 technique, 11 vision and 12 passing, yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a dead pivot. Let, it, let's be real, for a midfielder specifically, it's a dead pivot still. Now, man's got the work rate, the determination and the aggression. Gives me a sense of what kind of player this guy is already, bruv. Let's be real. Um, stamina, yeah, he's, he, he wants to be, a, he's not a destroyer though. Um, he, he is a box-to-box, but obviously not a brilliant one. He's kind of a bang average one. Yeah, that's what I'm getting from this guy. He is, like, because he can do pretty much a lot of things, yeah? Man, I'll just be like, you know what? Just, just do your little box to box thing. But I already know that man's capped at a certain level in it. Like, like he's, he's gonna be average. Let's be real. Like, he's not gonna be outstanding. He's just gonna be average still. Yeah, man, man, like Corey Smith. That's that's me being honest. Cool. All right, next, Matt Grimes, bruv, who is wanted. Let's see why he's wanted, bruv. Twenty five years of age, box to box midfielder. Now, 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 listen, listen, listen. Man, man's got that that fourteen pace in the midfield, bruv. Um, what's that? You can't you can't drive with the ball, which is fine as long as you've got a good pivot, which he does, bruv. Now, he's just recently he's escaped Youth Academy. That's about a couple of years ago. Listen now, technical ability is not really that great. Let's be real. But man's got the vision and the passing. So I'll definitely allow it. I can't lie. Decisions, they're okay. I mean, it's okay. 13 is under average by one. I have to allow it. I have to. And he can win the ball. So I think for me, he's actually a very good um, box to box. He is because man, for what you need him to do, man's got it in 14s and 15s, bro. And his first touch is complete as well. So, in terms of basics, yeah, that he's in control of, man's got them in it. Obviously, you can't really control your... Comp- I, I don't think you can control, like, certain mental things, composure, decision. You can't really control it. It's one of those things where you either have it or you don't. And he clearly doesn't have it, have it mentally, so... But what he can control, man's got it still. So, yeah. Man like Matt Grimes, he's a very, very good box-to-box midfielder still. Um, I can see some, someone like this in the Premier League. That's how good he is. Like, he's got a lot of 15s and 14s in there still. Very good. So, yeah, man like Matt Grimes, he, he's very good still. Cool. All right, next, who's wanted. And yes, I can definitely understand why Matt Grimes is wanted. Now, next, Jay Fulton, bro. Let's see why he's wanted. All right, um, 26, ball winning midfielder on defence. Um, this time, movement, 10 pace, 10 agility, 11 acceleration. The movement is gone. Um, uses outside of foot, bro. 14 technique, 12 vision, 12 passing. Not really um, a footballer in terms of... No, I'm not, I'm not, let me not disrespect him because man's actually got good technical ability. I mean, like he's not really like a brilliant passer of the ball. That's what I meant to say. Yeah. Now, he can win it very well, though. Not the best at marking. What's his positioning? Twelve. Yeah. Now, um, he doesn't really know when to go, when to stay. But he can win the ball. Um, he's a ball winning midfielder. He has to be a ball winning midfielder because his pivot isn't really the greatest. He's got very good technical ability, but that's about it. Um, dribbling is decent. Brave. Don't fear no one but God. Baby, get me. Um, mentally, thirteen work rate. Fourteen. Uh, yeah. He's not really. I mean, you know, you know, he's kind of aggressive, but that's not really enough. Let's be real. Um, for me, if he's a ball in the midfielder, um, uses outside of for he's. Yeah. I mean, he can get in the box and score as well. Is is he a bit more than a ball in the midfield? I think no, no, no. Because of his pivot, yeah, he has to. He probably has to be still. But um, there, there's definitely a bit more of his game that other ball in the midfielders don't have. For example, man can get in the box and score. He can kind of dribble. What's his first touch? Twelve. Some of them don't have stuff like this. So he's probably a better ball in the midfielder than a lot of other guys. Can't lie. Man like Jay Fort, and he's got a bit more about him. Still, I'll be honest, bruv. So yeah. My man like Jay Fulton, bruv. He's, he's good as well. All right, next, Conor Hurihan, bruv. Madness. Man like, man like my Aston Villa guy, bruv. Cool. All right, man, man like Hurihan, yeah. How can you let him go, bruv? He, he was, he's so good, bruv. Like, he's actually a baller still. I don't know why the man let him go. But anyway, um, man, I, I like this guy because when I was doing, if you haven't seen it already, man's doing a career with my friends, yeah. Man played this guy instead of Douglas Sweet. The only reason why is because he had a better pivot. I'll be honest, bruv. Like, I'm, I'm that kind of guy. Like, my, my simple footballers, like, I have to be real. Like, man was composed. He had a good pivot. I put him deep play and playmaker immediately. Regardless of his pace. Like, I don't care about pace in that sense, bruv. Now, obviously, man sees 11, 11, 11, 11. I'm seeing that. Like, in terms of strength, man's going to get fucked. But let's be real. In terms of strength, he's going to get fucked. In terms of movement, if one guy just kicks it random, they're, they're gone in it. 
like, like, like that guy's gone still. But obviously, one thing that I didn't clock is man's got a first touch of 12. That's that's not really that great if you're going to be under pressure a lot. Let's be real. But the composure that probably got him out of it, let's be real. Anyway, uh, man's got the work rate, man's got the determination, not really aggression though. Um, but like I said, that 14 technique, 14 vision, 14 passing pivot, that's what that's what I used him for, you get me? Um, yeah. But but overall, I think he's still a decent player. I mean, for Swansea, he's going to be amazing, bro. Like, he's he's going to dictate tempo, come deep to get the ball. I would delete that, try to play where I trouble check because man's got 10 dribbling in it. So he's not going to be, I mean, he might be press resistant in that sense. But in terms of tight spaces, a.k.a. trying to play your way out of trouble, I don't think he's going to be that great still. But yeah, overall, he, he is a good, um, I think he's a Premier League foot. I don't know why he's here, but I think these men can come to the Premier League. They're man third, so yeah. My man like Hurihan, he's, he's a very good player, still cool. All right, next, Jan Dahanda, bruv. All right, 21 years of age. Okay, um, Shadow Striker on attack. Usually from Shadow Strikers, I expect at least one of the three, like, gritty things. Like, you, you usually have, like, either work rate, determination, or aggression. He is 21, but obviously he's not going to have those. He, he doesn't have them now, so he never will have them, let's be real. Now, he's got a bit of flair, though, but anyway. Movement in terms of speed, not really there. In terms of side to side, he's actually moving. Um, so yeah, he's got he has got movement, just not at speed. Yeah, cool. Now, fifteen technique for envision for passing. He's not the he's not the best passer of the ball, but obviously with time, if he was to focus, let's say he was to focus on it, little little double intensity thing, man could definitely improve the pivot. Still, that could be a all fourteen plus pivot for all I know. It could still um, for a shallow striker. That's actually good because most of them actually cannot pass. Bruv, they're literally strikers that are deeper. Yeah, man like man like Yanda Handa now has got 16 composure, which is very, very good, bruv. Um, he can dribble, got a very good first touch, and he kind of knows where the goal is. That's all I needed from, from him still. Obviously, he's not a playmaker. Don't get confused. These shadow strikers, they're not playmakers. They're literally... The, all you have to do is look at them as if they're strikers themselves, bruv. That's all you have to do. And and that, that'll give you a little fair judgment of what you're going to get from him still. Um, he's not a playmaker. Hence why man's got the nine decisions. The determination, the, the the mentals, I'm just surprised that he actually has composure in it. So, yeah, my man, man like Yander Hand, I think he's a good player, though, for his age especially, in it? Like, he, he'll definitely get a lot of goals in this league, trust me. Yeah, man, man like Yander Hand, very good player still. All right. Next, um, Wayne Rutelej, bruv. This, this save would actually be like, I can't lie. Anyway, um, 16, technique, 11, 8, 8, 8 part madness. Anyway. 13 pace, 14 agility for acceleration. The movement is actually for a 35 year old. Really good, bro. I can't lie. Man's 35 year. Don't forget that, bro. You get me? Now, 14 flare, very good. 14 dribbling, very good. Now, obviously, this is what I see so many times, bro. Like, look at the value, bro. Madness. Anyway, I see I see um wingers like this all the time. I see them with, with the maddest movement or, or the maddest dribbling and flare. But then when the ball has to release your foot, it's, it's peak, bro. I can't lie. Like, man's got eight, like, like, like eight passing. 10 finishing what's the long shot 7 crossing and 9 like that's that's. I literally listed all the things that you need to leave the like leave the foot bruv like, like everything that you need to like release the ball is, is great <laughs> forget about it bruv I can't lie useless just tell man hang up the boots in it like literally B big man thing in it so yeah man, man like Wayne Rutilage bruv you get me cool alright next Andre Ayu bruv I think his brother is fake as fuck in this game bruv if you didn't know now you know bruv the one that's at um, Crystal Palace is fake bruv like in this game he's faking it let's see if his brother's the same and he's wanted let's see why fam oh wow man I just saw the dribbling immediately I was like yeah he is a T is too like he, he probably is too let's be real now obviously in terms of movement not, not blisteringly fast but he's moving side to side in it let's be real now man's brave determined Man's a, man's a leader as well. Man's got that work rate. So he's got the grit about him anyway. Now, in terms of the pivot, he's got very good technical ability. But obviously, the vision and the passing aren't really there. Meaning, I'm going to have to extract that technical ability. Put it in the dribbling and the flare, bruv. You get me? Like, look at him. Look, look at the way he's just going to be taking the piss out of guys, bruv. And he's left footed as well. He's going to be cutting and taking the piss. I'm so happy they didn't put him on inside forward on support. Because that would have been very, very dumb. Let him cut inside and just bang it first time. Because that's what I would do in it. And for some reason, I'm not even going to say for some reason. He can play striker in it. Like, he can still. Man's got a first touch. Man's got dribbling. I would play him striker still. Like, I'm putting him probably not even false nine. If it's a complete forward thing, I don't know because he can't pass the ball. I don't I don't even know if I put him on post because I think he could actually link play. I'll dare I say it, man, put him advanced forward still. Like, I think he'll get into very good positions, yeah, and his passing will let you down. But I think because his dribbling is so good, I think he could actually kind of pull it off because I know how this game, this game is fake in it. So, man, I'll just... 
accidentally pull it off a certain like big man thing he will still know man like I said man knows what the goal is in it so he's going to bang goals himself as well for me I'm putting him I'm putting him striker still because I think if he's out wide he's going to need a pivot and he doesn't have one so he needs to play striker still and and look at the weapons that he's got once again making someone like Batman look like a dicker because man just got bare weapons bro. Man, man just got bare weapons on his belt for example man's got the dribbling the first touch man bare strikers don't have that in the air 16 heading as well He's a striker, innit? Man like and- Andre Ayu. Very good striker still. Cool. All right, next. Jamal Lowe. 26 years of age. 13 technique, 11 vision and 11 passing. All right, 14 pace, 12 agility and 14 deliberation. Now, the movement is calm side to side, not really calm. Um, he is a left winger striker or right winger. He can dribble. And what's his flair? 15. First touch, a bit under average, so he's chasing that. And he kind of knows the goal. He kind of does know the goal is still. So, clearly... Take him off supporting. He's not someone to support no one. Put him on attack, if anything. And as you can see, he just needs to cut inside and bang it first time. That's it. Like, you see, I always compare these guys to Rashford, yeah? Like, just cut inside and bang it. Like, you, you don't play over your head up. You play over your head down. You can see it already. Um, that's if you want him to cut in as well. If, I, if anything, I'll probably have to ask him to cut in. I, I usually don't ask guys with agility like that to cut in there. But because of his stats and the way he actually is, I have to ask him to cut in still. Man, like Jamal Lowe. If anything, my will put him striker, but that'll be a little poacher thing in it. If let me just see what they will do. They put him advanced forward. I can understand why they did it, but obviously I put him poacher still. Yeah. Um but it's either it's either if it, if it's a one striker formation, I'm putting IU there. But if it's two, I'll play them together. I'll put him out wide though. But yeah, anyway, um Jamalo. Jamalo. Cool. Alright, next. Morgan Whittaker. Nineteen years of age. Alright, um, cool. 12 technique, 9 vision and 10 passing. All right. Um, not really a linker of the of the ball right now. But obviously he's 19, so I can definitely allow it still. Now, he's a winger, a striker or right winger. You've got three of them. That's very, very good, bro. I can't lie. If you're managing this team, you've got a lot of rotation because you could do a lot of interchanging because all three of them can play right winger, striker or left winger, which is very good. Now, in terms of movement, man's left only. I don't mind, though. Man's got 15 pace. 15 acceleration, so he's 19 and he's got pace, bruv, you get me? Very good to see. You know me. Who determined as well. Obviously, the first touch ain't there, but for his age, he knows where the goal is, innit? Um, you're going to have to focus on the fact that he can kind of dribble and know where the goal is. If anything, I think I'll play, I'll simplify his game, put him either straight line left wing, because that's simplifying his game, or put him put him a little poacher on striker, where, where he's just focusing on himself and getting his own goals. So it's either a straight line, run down the line, left wing thing, or just straight, um, or a poach away, just focusing on his own goal. Still, that's what I would do with him. So yeah, man like Morgan would take a still good youth player. All right. Next, um, on loan, Jordan Morris. 25 years of age, um, on loan from Seattle. Madness. All right. 11 technique, 9 vision, 11 passing. He claims to be an inverted winger on support. Forget about it, bro. You ain't supporting no one. You get me? It's not happening. No. Man's got very good pace though. Agility, not really there, but acceleration there. So he's, he's definitely probably a straight line kind of guy. He probably is still. Now, not really that composed. In tight spaces, can't really dribble. Once again, to my, to my fam, fam, man's actually another one that can play left wing, right wing and striker. That is very good. I can't lie. Um, they definitely have to do interchange thing. That would be a very fun save to do. I'm thinking now he's got nine composure in tight spaces. He's not really there. In terms of controlling the ball, he's not really there anticipation when it's 50 50 he's not winning none of that so in that sense it's, it's looking peak still so if it's out wide um is that going to help his situation he's never going to win the ball against a center back anyway like regardless of him being six foot but he's got 11 jump reach 12 heading in it he ain't beating no center back in the air um jordan morris i'm thinking how would i get the best out of this guy oh wait he's got 14 finishing he might have to be a poacher or even yeah i see pressing forward because he works hard and he's determined might have to be a pressing forward or a poacher because if he's a pressing forward, at least he'll be pressing his own dead first touch, bruv. You know the ones? Like, man's, man's going to be ducking down his own first touch anyway. You might as well put him on pressing forward, bruv. You get me? Man, man like Jordan Morris, bruv. Safe. You get me? Madness. Man, man, I'll just put him on pressing forward. You get me? Cool. All right. Next, Liam Cullen, bruv. 21 years of age. See, now this is um another another youth player. You get me? 10 pace, 12 agility for his generation. He's not blisteringly fast. What else does he have, though? Pivot, 12 technique, 11 vision, 11 passing. He's 21, I'll definitely allow it, you get me? Um, composure not really there. He works hard, determined, and he's a great... Yeah, so he's got a bit of grit about him as well. Pressing forward, I can definitely understand that. Their strikers, they're very complete still. Now, 
not really there with the first touch, but he knows where the goal is in it. Another striker that can finish, bruv. Um, and he's a bit fan. Man's got a bit of you know, man, man argues with official. You get me? You never know, bruv. Yeah, I think well for a little twenty-one year old guy, he's actually pretty. Man, man knows where the goal is. I think I'll definitely not call him a lost cause. That's that's the bottom line in it. So yeah, um, he's got potential still. That's what matters. So yeah, um, loan listed. He could probably make a he could probably make a breakthrough, but I'll probably I don't know I, you know I'll, I'll I'll keep him so I wouldn't put him on loan I'll definitely keep someone like this still yeah man like Liam Cullen he, there, there's a there's a player there still cool now that is Swansea um little, little little review of what I've just gone through now um if I'm being honest yeah they're actually not a bad team like man I have to actually look out for these guys because I ain't heard no one speaking about them you know. Like, big man thing. Man, when man talk about championship, I only hear the teams like Watford, flipping Brentford, um, Norwich. I don't hear about Swansea. Like, I, I genuinely don't hear about Swansea in it. So, man probably need to just keep on doing their little low-key thing. No one needs to know that their man are just picking up points and they're currently sitting third in the championship. No one needs to know that next season they could be in the flipping Premier League. No one needs to know that. But just keep on doing your thing on the low. You get me? If you're a Swansea fan... Fam, you, your team could be in the Premier League season for all I know, because that, that, the team that I just went through, that's actually a decent team. That's actually a very good team. Like, I, fam, I can't lie, that would be a fun save to do still. So yeah, man, like Swansea, they're decent still. So yeah, um, obviously I remember this Chegg Man United for Danger. That don't matter anyway, cool. Now, um, let's see how I line these men up, you get me? They're, they're a very good team still. All right, so this is how I'm going to line up Swansea, you get me? Um, man's got Woodman in goal. You get me? He's injured though, but that that's a problem, and I can't lie, that's a problem. You're gonna have to actually play this um what's his name? This hammer guy. But if it's only temporary, it's fine. It's not long, it's not long. So yeah. Um oh wait, no, this guy's on loan, so it might be long still. You, you're gonna have to buy another goalkeeper. Yeah. Anyway, left back on support, bid well. Man man had to put him on support because he can't attack as they claim that he can. Fight what they fight what they claim in it, man. Man tells you what what you should do. Listen, put him on support, trust me now. Um, Gehi or no nonsense, yeah. He's, I think, for now, he should be a no nonsense still. Maybe in the future, if his pivot does improve, you can put him on ball playing. But for now, put him on no nonsense still. Then you got Bennett, who's actually, actually, now I put him on central. I remember put him on central defender. I actually allow him being on central defender still. Then you got um Roberts right back, yeah. That's that's calm now. Hurian in that midfield. That's a very good midfield right there. Hurian and Grimes. That's a good um little pivot right there. Now, cutting inside is low. The hander as the shadow striker. And then you've got more. I put this guy wide poacher because that's what he is, in it? He's a wide poacher still. Um, Literally. man, or, or even a normal poacher. But I don't want to put IU out wide. That's the thing. So I'm going to have to sacrifice that and put him, put him poacher still. And then IU, put him anywhere in, in, in that striker. But probably not a linker, actually. Yeah. Advance forward. I, I don't think he's going to be um, as effective as he, if he's linking play. But if he's like on that dribbling thing then I think he'll be absolutely ridiculous bruv as as you've seen in it so yeah man I are you cool now that is Swansea bruv so yeah you man one more time um I've got a career mode coming I think this is going to be the last episode of player ratings before I upload, and, I, and I don't mean the last episode of player ratings over I mean just before I upload a new career that's what I mean in it so yeah um yeah but but obviously I can't comp- confirm shit in it so yeah you man if you like the video like the video subscribe to the content you know what to expect from me I'll see you in my next episode bruv so.